Hello, my name's Bob Willis, and welcome to Defect of the Month, uh, brought to you by the NPL Defect Database. Now, voids in solder joints do occur, and what we're trying to do is reduce or eliminate them. Now, the voids in a solder joint may have no impact, or very small impact, in the solder joint reliability, but what we want to try and do is understand how they've come about and also eliminate them. Now, we always blame, well, most people always blame the profile or the solder paste. However, always look to see whether something else is interacting. And over the last few years, I've seen many interactions of the board, the board manufacturing process, obviously the design, but also plating on components. Now, if you get outgassing, uh, wherever it's coming from, whether it's moisture or organics in the plating, it can create voids in your solder joint. So dig a little deeper, don't expect that it's always the profile or the paste, but look to see and do some testing. And you can do some fairly easy simulation testing on plating materials to see outgassing, as I show in the illustration.